Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? Richard Jared, Cosmic Wander, jumping on, giving you the big what's up. Hope everybody's doing awesome out there. I uh, just always like jumping on and uh, spreading that love, that light, the, uh, the uh, power of the universe within me going out there to you. Hopefully uh, bringing you a, a grin, a smile, or you know, whatever, to better your day. Anyway, you know me, I always like digging, reading, doing amazing research. Just because, you know, for any old body, the common man. Why not? <laughs> we have uh, a lot of access to uh, that knowledge, so it's pretty amazing. I've been doing a lot of research into uh, decoding the Bible, which it's pretty amazing when it's, you know, someone like me, if I can do it, anybody can do it. But it can seem a little challenging. Especially. Especially depending on who you talk to, you know, this day and age, it's still pretty uh, touchy subject because it's been drilled in the brains of so many people on there's only one interpretation, and that's literal. And I think so many people get offended when you start literally, literally you know, when you try to talk to them about those little translations because they're just so silly, you know, and so far out and go against anything that, you know, you know, you've never seen happen, you'll never see happen, you know, talking snakes, you know, just crazy shit, you know, but uh, once you understand the symbolism and, and the things that are being taught there, Holy shit, it's teaching you, it blows your mind far beyond talking snakes. Um, which, you know, for people that have done the experimental research into psychedelics, there is uh, a giant talking serpent in the, in the, uh, in the claims of many, I personally have never seen the talking serpent. But I have gone face to face with the Almighty. And it's nothing like what most people think. And it's because it's in, inside of us, it's in our mind. And, and there's no middlemen required, you know. But it's so hard for people to understand that. But now we've gone so far in our medical our medical, uh, if you look at Gray's Anatomy, you get a medical, a Stedman's Medical Dictionary. And these are used by the, the universities. We can really look at the functioning of the brain, the secretions that are flowing, the, the blood that that's circulating throughout the body, uh, the function of individual organs, and just amazing things that go in inside our bodies without us even thinking about it. It's just about us maintaining those things in harmony and get through uh, life without serious diseases and disorder. And in this day and age, it's kind of hard to do with the amount of uh, stress-filled, toxic radicals floating around, just crazy stuff that's been allowed by, you know, loose loose regulations when it comes to um, certain things, so uh, it's crazy. So it's a good time to empower ourselves with the knowledge that we can download on the hard drive, which, you know, the ancients knew this was a supercomputer, and that's why it was, you know, very important to keep it on the straight, straight, narrow path, because when it, off course it's just 
it's just it could be it could be terrible and and when terrible things happen that's when greed and materialism and consumerism and desensitizing from you know just atrocious acts that are allowed to go on just simply because we all turn a blind eye to uh, so this I believe when we look at it correctly um, it will dissolve those issues and those symptoms that we have in the collective and uh, lift up you know each individual that really truly understands what's really being taught here and, and especially in the Bible so we're dealing with the brain the mind the splitting of the atom uh, the physiology the forming of the spine um, and and so it's 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 an, it's crucial to understand that and then they knew the relationship with that and the zodiac and it was one and the same, it was a small version of the big version. So, uh, the head was the heavens, where the sun and the moon are, are uh, working, you know. And you got glands that are doing the same functions that these things do in the universe. Bring forth the secretions of the earth through the sun and moon. So it's really cool. But anyway, guys, I gotta jump off. I'm just like zoning out and trying to drop that knowledge. I feel compelled to, you know, especially in this day and age. Um, I always love sitting down and chatting with some church goers that are wrapped up on the uh, the followings of the churches, which you know Jesus wasn't a big fan of. Um, so. Yeah, I'm here to tell you guys, you, you got to start looking at it in the right light if you're uh, really about the truth, because the truth is, these aren't literal stories, these are stories of you, about your body, and when you elevate yourself to those realms of consciousness, and communi communion with the, uh, the true and living God, and you can't put a name on it. So anyway, back at your gas, one love, peace out.